Zara asked me to bring him a sample from that bolter I saw in front of the school. He said they'd been spotted in specific areas of the city, so I should focus my search in those places. He also said I needed to get that sample back to him while it was still fresh. So I gotta move. What can I do for you? Doc Zara says you know where I should look for these, uh, bolters. Super fast infected, covered in big green blisters. Oh yeah, yeah. I can point you in the right direction. Here, here, and here. Though you ask me, if trouble don't come looking for you, no reason to go looking for trouble. <laughs> Words to live by, thanks. Can I assist you? What's up, Spike? Just FYI, if you need me, I'll be at the ferry station helping Morgan prep the barge.
You need something? I'm a I've been 24 hours. Okay, Doc. Here comes your chunk of zombie guts. Come in, come in. Did you get the samples I asked for? Excellent, excellent. I was just telling Dr. Camden about Hello, you. Hello, Mr. Crane. Glad to have you working with us. You uh, sound like an impressive individual. Interesting stuff what passes for blood in this creature. 
photosensitive. Quite deadly if used on a weapon, I'd wager. But I digress. My last bit of reagent here, and a reserve vial of, oh my word, this tissue, it's testing positive for the recombined virus. Camden, do you know what this means? The meat experiment worked. When I dose the meat samples with the altered strain, it's had an effect. This could explain all the different mutations. But I can't. Camden could. He has the equipment. But we have no way to get the research to him. You can talk to him on the radio. Why not share the info that way? There's too much data, Crane. It would take years. We'd both be dead and gone before he finished. Water, water everywhere. And not a drop to drink. What if I delivered this stuff to you, Dr. Camden? By hand. The data and the tissue samples both. Crane, getting from there to here would be insanely dangerous. Yeah, but it could mean a cure, right? You don't know how much this means, dear boy. To me, to all of us. I'll contact you when everything's ready. You must go now. Much to do. Much to do.